eighth grade. Step two for your self-portrait project is adding some things to the background. It can be random designs such as flowers, shapes, um, like a doodle, like a zentangle, um, or you can do a, like a combination or um, you could add things about yourself. So I'm taking the time to draw a flower. Um, so I'm just going to fast forward through this, adding some details. Um, really, really going to town on the flowers. Um, and then I'm just starting to draw some of my interests, trying to create balance of where I'm placing things in the position. Um, the nice thing about the, the fact that we're drawing on a clear plastic um, like sheet is you could possibly hold up this plastic sheet to your computer and trace an, an image that you find on Google or if you possibly are somebody at home and you have a printer you could always print out um, something that you want to add and trace over it I will allow that um, but so essentially this is kind of similar to the first step where you're just adding um, with Sharpie some some details and they're not like necessarily too um, filled in with a bunch of lines and details, um, starting to, trying to stick with that contour line and then filling in a little bit more. Um, but I would say try to fill your space so that it looks full, not too full. Um, think about the sizing of how and where you're going to put things. And yeah, that's pretty much this second step. This should take you a while. Obviously, I'm, um, pressing fast forward and I kind of had this already planned out in my head but um, take your time try to show some of your interests try to design this so it's unique and creative and then at the end I'm gonna fast forward this this is what mine looks like so you can see that um, you can still see kind of like the main Thing that we want to show off is our self-portrait but then in the background I kind of have things overlapped placed balanced well my face is my space is filled and it looks uh, pretty balanced all right if you have any questions feel free to email me um, if not then all right bye <laughs>